As expected, of course, more reactions have continued to trail the call for the sale of Nigeria's national assets. Here are the views expressed by some financial analysts we spoke to earlier. On my conditional uh, support for that sale of assets, that the process of the sale must be, invest, must be invested in other economically uh, viable or economically uh, important assets, such that the assets that will be reclassified from selling off existing assets to the new assets will have beneficial, multiple beneficial effects to the economy. And my take is that that investment should go into transport infrastructure. If we are selling our shares in the JV joint venture assets or in NLNG, then that money should go into critical infrastructure like um, the highways or the standard guardrails. Money coming from the extractive industry, it, it should be used, should be invested in trying to improve the environment. So you put infrastructure in place, you build industries, you, you know, and so on, you increase power supply, and you, know, you make the environment more attractive. That, that endures. But when you not take it and consume it, now that means you are, being, you are denying the, the following generation, you know, the opportunity of, of this asset. And this asset should belong to all of us. So I think it's something that's very difficult. But then, like I said, if, we, if you can't, if you're having difficulties with uh, attracting uh, uh, loans, like we say, want to attract, and you're not coming to us, we're not getting it, and we now need to reflect this economy because we can't continue to go this way, then nothing is off limits. So we can sell it and then hope that we can sell it and make better use of it. And if we can do that, then we expect that uh, as we go forward, we will put the environment, you know, and so on and so forth.